Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Ahmed. Welcome back to another video. I got loads of footage for you. Got grass and gym. Because I realized I've got months and months of training footage from when I wasn't releasing videos and I want to start sharing it with you. And I don't have access to a gym right now, so it's going to be higher level tricks. So to start the video off, enjoy this gym footage from I don't even know where. We got everything we need right here. Wine and burning chemistry. Write down all your memories, feel the things you wanna feel lovely tree that is so i hope you guys enjoyed that gym footage i'm currently sat in the park because i've just finished up filming a video for kojo's trick lab on how important grass training is so if you're interested in checking it out then click the link in the description and sign up to kojo's trick lab there's tons and tons of information on there for anybody of any level if you want to start doing tricks or if you can already do tricks there's always going to be something you can learn but moving on so in my last video i asked you guys to share some of the achievements that you've accomplished during the quarantine period so i'm trying to mix the locations up for this video but i'm pretty limited as to what i can do because i can't go anywhere or do anything so you're just going to see me in various parts of this park <laughs> your accomplishments let's let's talk about that 
so first of all, I just want to mention you guys showed mad love on the previous video and thank you to everybody that did send me something. But I can't mention everybody because obviously this video would be like 25 minutes long otherwise. So, so first up, I just want to mention there was somebody called Jules EY and they said they did a painting of their stepdad. But I looked on their Instagram and it was private. So tip number one, make sure you're not private or just send it to me on Instagram. Just give me something to work with, but I'm, I'm sure it's sick. <laughs> Right, so I need to mention this guy called James BRTN. This is something that I think is super dope. It makes me happy to hear about this kind of tale. So I'm going to put the comments somewhere on the screen so you can have a proper look at it and read through if you want. He basically said that he just finished his first big film project and he managed to raise £3,750 off the back of it. It makes me so happy to hear that somebody's following their passion because he used to work in a Dairy Queen and now he's earning nearly $4,000 from one film project. And he learned cart dub, started his own clothing brand and he's doing all kinds of bits put his handle here but that's super sick it makes me super hyped to hear that you're making so much progress and just keep killing shit so obviously i've got to shout out my boy quantum blitz i see him comment on every single one of my youtube videos and i read every comment i try and respond to as many comments as i can i'm gonna respond to every single comment on this video because you guys are showing so much love on all the videos recently and i appreciate all of you but quantum blitz i don't know your actual name sorry brother but he uh did this now he said in the caption that the only times he'd landed this in the past were on sprung floor. Your Webster's kind of crazy as well. It's got some weird lift thing going on that doesn't really make that much sense. But shouts to you, Quantum Blitz, for killing it. Owen Tricks on Instagram sent me some footage of him landing his first ever touchdown raise double fall. I think it was his first double fall ever. Yeah, his first double fall. Yo, that's super sick. <laughs> changing experience when I landed my first double fall so I know how you feel brother keep crushing it now I want to give you one tip because it looks like you're kind of approaching it almost as if it is a fall with another twist just as you're taking off try and think about tensing up and straightening out that body so it's just one continuous motion and you've got your quads your glutes and everything super tense so that you can make the twist as fast as possible and actually increase speed while you're twisting but super sick keep working on it G. so I'm just going to mention one more achievement which was by Michael Rainbow Sue <laughs> he said he learned cart full and he can almost do double B twist now. Make sure you're staying safe with the double B training and I hope you get it soon. If you want me to do this again, then let me know in the comments. Maybe I'll do it for the next video too. <laughs> So, before I finish the video, I just got a couple more things I want to say. First of all, thank you to everyone who's ordering from Soul Piety. I still have a few of... Jesus, that was a lot. We still have a few of these left on the website, and there's only two of the black Soul Piety t-shirts with the question marks. So hit the link in the description and grab yourself one of these tees before they're completely sold out. And I don't think I'm going to be doing a run of them ever again. So if you want one, now is probably going to be your last chance. And the other thing that I wanted to mention was Kojo and I are thinking about doing live streams on Instagram and kind of reviving the Armored and Kojo show, but just doing it live on Instagram. So drop a comment and let us know anything that you want us to talk about or any questions that you have about mine or Kojo's lives or our training or anything. It doesn't have to be tricks related, whatever you want to know. And at some point we'll probably end up talking about it but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna finish the video with a grass session but before we get to that make sure you hit the subscribe button like the video drop me a comment and everybody that shares this video on their instagram story and tags me i'll repost it get sharing turn your notification bell on and i'll see you guys soon for another video much love boost <laughs>
trying to piece together a combo, really trying to implement some strange direction changes and different levels and using basic moves to create something that's a little bit more unique. to getting strong again but this is what it takes reps on reps on reps every video it's just gonna be better i know the process i know it's frustrating but i need to make sure that the technique's right i don't want to just be forcing things i want to make sure i've got the correct technique so it takes this <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I didn't think anyone was watching. <laughs>